I am finally back in my LA apartment. Thank the Lord. Uh, I had uh, dinner postmated and it came right on time, which was awesome. I quickly made the bed. So now I'm gonna take a shower, uh, get all comfy cozy, have some dinner, do a little self care, and then go to bed because my pickup tomorrow is at 7 a.m. Good morning, guys. Um, it is 7.26 in the morning, and I'm headed off to the shoot day. Um, but first, we have to get COVID tested. Okay, so we finally got to the location. This is the bus that we're doing glam and wardrobe changes in. And I wanted to show you guys the beautiful, beautiful location that we'll be shooting at today. Get ready, you guys. It's stunning. The El Matador State Beach. It's definitely walked down. There's some stairs. Stunning. One of the coolest parts about working and doing all these different photo shoots is being able to come to all these really cool locations. Okay, I'm now in the hair and makeup trailer slash wardrobe trailer and I will show you around. Also, it's a stress reaction, I get it every single time I'm stressed. Hopefully Melissa, and I'm sure she will be able to clean it up. I'm gonna show you guys some of the beautiful fashion. Love this, so pretty. So pretty, all these textures, we have the shoes. Ah. And look! It makes you look really nice and blurred out. Hold on. Ooh, yes. <laughs> yeah, I love it. <laughs> Change room. <laughs> we're on the beach and we do not want to walk up and down and up and down every single time we have to change. So check it out. <laughs> Hey you guys, I just got home from my first ever Vogue shoot. I am so beyond thrilled with how it turned out. I like had to pinch myself. Like a true pinch, like pinch yourself moment. I was standing on a rock and there was like waves spraying up all over me and it just, I was like, oh my God, I'm shooting Vogue. 
Like it's just been such a huge milestone for me, something that I've been wanting to do for such a long time. So I feel really honored to be able to do it and the team was great. You know, my team, I feel, I feel so loved and supported and so lucky to work with them. And I'm so happy with the photos. The photographer was amazing. All of the outfits, the styling, like everything was honestly really like dreamy. Tom did these really cool iridescent fingernails on me, which I love. I love a claw. Here's the thing you guys, I was really worried about COVID and just nervous in general about flying and bringing crews together and shooting because of all the cases going up. Um, but you know, we were outside, everyone was masked up, social distanced. I felt comfortable and safe and, and I'm so happy that I did it. I just love working with such creative, awesome artists. I can't say enough how excited I am for you guys to see it. Vogue is just something that I wanted to do forever and I was like, oh my God, now I'm doing it. <laughs> Tomorrow I get to go home and see Anthony and Emmy again, and I'm so excited. So now I'm having a little dinner date. Guess who? Yay, baby! Yeah! I got some John and Vinny's. Ooh. Oh, baby. Ooh, you want a slice, babe? Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. Please. Why isn't this working? Just hand, Take a just big hand, bite. Just, just hand me the pizza. <laughs> Take a big bite. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it. Yes. Post Vogue dinner. Ooh. Good morning, everyone. I am getting ready to head to the airport and head home. I have Anthony on FaceTime here. Anthony, say hello. What's up? <laughs> um, we fell asleep talking to each other um, last night on FaceTime, but I was, we were like talking to each other, but I was also watching SpongeBob. So we had FaceTime on all night, which is typically what we do when we are apart. It's very cute. Stop.